big things happening today. It's all come together. I just went downstairs and I got my packages and one of them is this foam mattress topper. I have not been sleeping well lately so I'm really glad that I have this. And then I also got this tapestry. And now it's time for some lunch. So normally what I do at the beginning or at some point each week is I make like a bulk of something in my Instant Pot. Now I'm going to make some seared mushrooms and sage for my light dinner. Sometimes I eat before class, sometimes I eat after class. I don't really have time to make a full meal right now, so I'm just gonna see how it works out. did not last long, but it was so good. Now I have to get ready for class. So I use a fanny pack instead of a purse or a backpack because I'm not comfortable carrying a backpack with my laptop in it at night. I just think that it makes me a target. Maybe that's a bad assumption, but that's how I feel. Oh, time for class. Back from class. Pretty good class. Hello. I have a lot of work to do today. I have a massive coding project that's due this week and I'm behind on it, but it seems like everyone else is too, so that kind of makes me feel better. And they even like gave us a bit of an extension. I took a shower this morning. Yes, this is my natural hair. Not the color, but the texture. It, it is very curly and this is still a bit dry. It'll keep growing. Exactly. I just had my lab, but I already did the lab this week and I already submitted it So I didn't really need to pay attention. I just had to get those attendance points and now I need to finish the Homework assignment. I have a virtual doctor's appointment today. Hopefully I can get this homework assignment done It's taking me forever. It's taking everyone in my class forever Off to get some dinner I ate dinner hours ago, but I got back to work right after I ate dinner and I just got off the phone with my advisor Yes, she took my call very late at night. Thank God. It's time to just watch some TV relax Balance I've been on hold with the financial aid office for 10 minutes finally off the phone with them with no answers so I got to do it all over again later this is definitely gonna be considered weird but I put everything bagel seasoning in my overnight oats after I heat it up because it gives it like a salty crunch really compliments the chocolate. I'm gonna go to Trader Joe's, do all my grocery shopping, and I need to go to Walgreens, and then I'm gonna come back here, unload everything. I'm gonna do a deep apartment clean, like scrub the counters, and I'm going to do some reading. Maybe I'll go to the library for that, and then I've got class. Today's the day. Today is the day that I wear my Barney coat. Oh yeah. 
called fashion. Bingo. I'm ready. I got to Walgreens and the pharmacy's closed. They told me to come back in two, which is in 15 minutes. So now I'm just waiting by the tampons until they open. I have all my bags. It's so heavy. Oh my God, that took so long. Finally home. <laughs> when did I need to start working out again? <laughs> I just cleaned my bathroom, my kitchen, and everything in between with this. I'm now off to class, but I'm really early, so I'm either gonna go to the library. It was a good class, all about like research and writing academic journals and getting publications and designing legitimate scientific experiments. It's dense and it's a very long course, but it's extremely informative and necessary for my degree. I've already showered and I'm so tired, I'm so sleepy. I'm just gonna probably make like a cup of tea and watch TV and just relax. I don't have class tomorrow, so I don't have to wake up early. And yeah, I'll see you in the morning. Hello, so I finished working out. I took a shower, got dressed, and now I'm gonna make some coffee and then I'm gonna go to the library and just get all my weekend homework done, all my reading done. I'm bringing coffee, I'm bringing water, and I'm bringing two of these. I really like them because they're high fiber so they keep you full because normally when I go to libraries, at least in undergrad, I used to like find excuses to leave and normally that excuse was I'm hungry and I want to go get food. So if I bring something, I can't leave. In order to get into the classrooms, we have to complete this daily screener, which is linked to like our latest COVID tests and stuff like that. And so when you go into any NYU affiliated building, you have to show the pass like for the daily screener and you have to show your student ID. It's a bit of a process to like get the daily screener because it's like a few pages of questions every day. But I mean, I'm glad that they're actually doing something to keep their students safe. I can't find my apartment keys. <laughs> But yeah, anyways, I know it's like kind of controversial because you're only allowed to do it if you're authorized to be on campus. So you can be an NYU student and be taking all online classes and you can't come on campus even if you live here. Um, some people don't like that, but it's because like if you're an in-person student, then you get COVID tested every two weeks and they don't want people who don't get COVID tested every two weeks to come on campus, so.
I just got home from the study space and I think I'm gonna end the video here. It's been a pretty accurate week in my life. If you've made it this far, thanks for watching. If not, it doesn't matter. <laughs> See you next time.